In this video, I'm going to discuss all the different settings available to you on a Makita cordless jigsaw. So, first thing we need to discuss is the variable speed trigger. So, this doesn't have any speed settings on the body of the jigsaw itself. To alter the speed of the jigsaw, it's all on this trigger. So, you can start the jigsaw off slow, like that, and then if you slowly squeeze the trigger, the speed will increase until you reach full speed. So that's all your speed settings are on the trigger. There aren't any other spin wheels or turn buttons. Now, to make your jigsaw safe, Makita included this lock feature here at the top. So if your jigsaw is locked, it won't, you won't be able to use the trigger. If you click it the other way, you can use the trigger. So when not in use, it's always best to lock it so it can't accidentally go off. On all jigsaws, and these Makita ones, you normally have some settings here at the front. These dictate how much pendulum action you have. Now jigsaws work in two ways. If your settings on here, which is zero, your jigsaw blade just goes up and down. Whereas if you alter this, it increases the pendulum. So your jigsaw blade will actually move backwards and forwards as it goes up and down. So you get kind of this kind of motion, sort of more circular motion of the jigsaw, which can help improve its speed of cut. But you also run the risk the higher you turn this, of creating more spelching on your workpiece. So it's always best to start your jigsaw off on straight up and down and then slowly increase the pendulum to help increase the speed of your cut. So I'll just show you that now so you can see it. So this is no pendulum. You can see the jigsaw blade runs quite straight, whereas if I increase the pendulum, you'll see it sort of kicks out and looks a bit more aggressive. So yeah, you can see those two different settings. So I normally recommend start it on no pendulum, but you do find as you get more confident that these pendulum settings are really quite useful at speeding through your cuts. So you've got your variable speed trigger, you've got your lock, and then you've got your pendulum action here. And that's all there is to it. There are all the settings on your Makita cordless 18 volt jigsaw.